Welcome back and with us now live over the phone is our dear guest Karimane El Habel and she's a tourism expert. Good morning uh, Mrs. Karimane. Good morning. How are you doing? Uh, fine, thank you. Uh, so uh, let us talk about this very important event that is going to take uh, place on the peak of summer. Uh, uh, Egypt is opening new Alamein festival as we all know and everybody in the Arab world is awaiting in uh, participation already Arab tourists and uh, some uh, p people from neighboring countries are booking to spend their vacations in new Alamein to attend this festival so uh, could this be taken as the largest event inside the Middle East now Okay, we can start by saying that uh, Egypt's new Alamein uh, city on the north coast uh, is planned to host uh, about uh, the new Alamein Entertainment Festival in uh, will be held in 2023 this year, which is the biggest um, uh, entertainment festival in the Middle East uh, starting th Thursday, 13 of July. Uh, and uh, uh, um, and will be uh, will be uh, along for uh, August uh, the the date of August uh, middle of August or the uh, from the 13th of July to 26th of August uh, in the um, uh, coastal Mediterranean Sea about 100 kilometer west of Alexandria and 180 kilometers east of the Marsa Matru, right. the adult city. The festival will include concerts for famous international Arab and Egyptian singers at Alamein Romanian Theater. So the first concert will be on 21st of July for popular Egyptian pop stars, the star, um, and we open uh, actually by Lebanese um, uh, gangs and um, concerts. Aside from the concert, uh, the festival will include sports, cultural, and uh, other activities. Uh, also, the festival will host a beach uh, soccer uh, tournament uh, on 13 uh, 15th of July, uh, featuring 40 football stars. Mm. Uh, the festival also will host um, uh, uh, a Tepero Bowl uh, tournament uh, featuring the world um, champion Brazilian star uh, and Serbians and uh, from all over the world. Uh, also, will host a fashion show, a fashion show uh, featuring the best uh, ten Arab fashion designers. New Alamein will uh, later host um, a, a triathlon a tournament on uh, RC aircraft show, a, row, a rowing tournament uh, of a jet ski challenge and an international paddling championship. So the festival aims uh, to attract more than one million tourists in, from Egypt uh, and the Arab world. Uh, we got you, uh, you can also uh, follow the updates of the New Alamein Festival through, uh, uh, through, through all uh, the, uh, the, the lines and uh, the channels. So uh, um, mm. will, will be a, a very, very big uh, aim and very, very big opening for uh, the site of the tourism in uh, in, in uh, Egypt will help Egypt to uh, to um, uh, to contain the big number of uh, of uh, tourists by the the hotels, uh, the housing, uh, the restaurants uh, uh, will be uh, uh, the Alamein city about uh, um, uh, one fifty. Uh, Kilometers, uh, thousand kilometers square, uh, full of all the activities, uh, resorts, uh, hotels. Uh, all of this will be ready um, uh, to host uh, the, a very big number uh, of tourists. Right, we're talking about a very uh, exclusive ex touristic experience 
that has never happened inside the Middle East. And besides, add to that that Egypt is also ranking as one of the top-notch countries when it comes to the coastal cities' tourism. And it, uh, the, the, especially the summer tourism uh, in Egypt is, becomes booming at this, part, this time of the year. Talking um, particularly about uh, the new Alamein as a new coastal city, a modern one that is um, um, a d diverse in its culture. I mean, there is a touristic experience that includes the beach area. The, we have the uh, historical area. We have the cultural city, which is known as the, the city of arts. I mean, there are many, many places uh, um, uh, that is unlike the usual stereotyped coastal city. I mean, it's totally different. How can we describe this experience and what exactly are we expecting uh, to have as an outcome from all uh, uh, these uh, uh, parts or all these places inside the new Alamein? So uh, we are talking about the new Alamein uh, so we can uh, uh, drop the light on it. And aside from uh, the festival, New Alamein City has its uh, own dedicated uh, city of art featuring a cinema complex, an opera house, uh, mm. a museum, and the heritage quartier uh, preserve the heritage of the city of Alamein. Uh, nearest of it, the, uh, an airport uh, to New Alamein, it's also a, a very big facility. Uh, to, uh, this is a very big international airport also, uh, which is about 30 uh, kilometers away. Uh, there is also Burj Al Arab International Airport, aside of west of, uh, uh, of Alexandria. All of uh, this are facilities to, uh, to receive the very huge big number of tourists. Mm. Uh, and uh, this across uh, uh, 48, about 48, I think, uh, thousand uh, acres uh, with the investments uh, over uh, Egypt. 40 billion new Alamein has the capacity to host uh, about um, 4 million people. Uh, it's not only a resort city but also um, a fully working uh, year-round city and the second uh, administrative capital uh, for all over, over Egypt. So uh, Egypt is not only the monument, uh, uh, the traces of uh, our, exactly. uh, uh, one of the biggest uh, civilization in the ancient world. Uh, we have uh, uh, we have the sea, the, the uh, too many kind of tourism, uh, exactly. uh, culture, uh, monuments, seas, uh, 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 shores, uh, and, and so. So this is a very big aim to uh, visit and uh, to assist to this uh, uh, huge festival. Right. Uh, my final question to you, I know that you are a tourism expert and uh, evaluating the whole experience as a, uh, a season for tourism. How is that going to change the map of tourism for Egypt in general? I mean, the type of tourists, uh, the type of tourism, uh, what the type of activities and that is of all in the end is going to come to the best interest of our venues and economy, of course. Yes, of course, it will infuse uh, on it uh, the, uh, and will boom. Egypt uh, is uh, from uh, is uh, counted from uh, the first uh, five uh, uh, capitals uh, to uh, or cities uh, or uh, countries to attract uh, tourism in the in the incoming um, uh, um, season of tourism and uh, is booming with uh, and we are also preparing our staff to host uh, the a huge number millions and millions uh, about uh, uh, more than 20 million uh, tourists uh, by uh, hotels by uh, 
facilities, by transportation, airports, hot, uh, all of this to be, uh, to be ready to host the very big number of it. So, of course, we'll help Egypt to increase more and more and uh, to have its uh, rank between the other countries in uh, the, the, the right. field of tourism. Right, uh, Mrs. Kariman El Habel, the tourism expert, would like to thank you so much. Talking to the breakfast show, and you have a beautiful day. And we're going to go to a short break, and we'll come to continue the breakfast show, so stay with us.